the, the motivation for establishing uh, the comprehensive special school in Nigeria is first of all to create awareness to both disabled people and the able people to know that there are certain categories of people that require certain special care and also to start our children who happen to be disabled a proper footing to make life worthwhile and meaning to them and to their country. Disability in Nigeria is seen as a curse, and so people discriminate against persons with disabilities. Do you know that the resorting culture has really denied these Nigerians of their right to the dignity of the human person and to the development of their full potential to participate in the development process of Nigeria? Do you also know that the government doesn't give sufficient attention to persons living with disabilities in Nigeria? Despite the fact that this has been the unfortunate narrative, the story is being changed in National State Nigeria by the establishment of the Comprehensive Special School Lafia under the outstanding servant leadership prowess of Governor Tango. One might say the motivation behind the establishment of this one-of-a-kind special school is political. The governor, he is the designer of the school. But what the school is, is beyond his imagination. I can tell you this. There are certain things that I know that the governor does not even know. He does not know that what he is doing has touched the life of a common person in Nigeria and beyond. But to Governor Amakura, it goes deeper than politics. It is out of passion and compassion. The fact that I'm able and capable of doing whatever I want to do does not make me a happy person. If at the end of the day, I cannot pinpoint aspect of my activities that assists or helps someone to enjoy his living. So that passion, that philosophy had been in me right from childhood. The establishment of the special school to Governor Almakura is the fulfillment of the preoccupation of the political party that brought him into power. The occupation of our, our great party, the APC, is to ensure the total practicalization of those values that relate to social justice, inclusiveness, and provision of equal opportunity for all kinds of people, particularly those with disabilities. Comprehensive Special School Lafia is a government-supported school and the students will attend the school at no cost to them. The school will provide effective and functional education for students with disabilities. This includes students who are deaf and hard of hearing, students who are blind or have low vision, students with physical disabilities, students with autism spectrum disorders and developmental disabilities, all from nursery up to primary levels for the time being. Justifying the fact that the school is indeed special, it was commissioned colorfully 
by His Excellency, the Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Muhammad Buhari GCFR, on the 6th of February 2018. Special school Lafia was celebrated and welcomed by the citizens of Nasara State of Nigeria. the special school lafia one can't but say governor almaku cares for women. been admitted, teachers are recruited, and instructions for students have commenced. Uh, the special school is equipped with modern facilities such as smart boards, whiteboards, braille machines, and computers. Special School Lafia has hostels for students and housing accommodations for teachers. Knowing quite well that starting something new needs guardians and professional counsel, Governor Almakura collaborated with professionals. Uh, yes, because we are trying this for the first time. All this while, uh, the kind of system we management and education of people with disabilities uh, is to be a homegrown type. It is what I might call analog. Uh, things that you just uh, 
do it by trial and error until maybe you are able to stumble into something that is related to you. So with that kind of pedigree and foundation, uh, we are not likely to extend except we interface, collaborate and partner with those countries and areas and those countries and places where they have had the opportunity of the evolution of the system uh, to the extent where they attain certain excellence or best practice. So if we have to also go along with the global trend and modern approach towards this sector, we cannot but carry uh, for the association, collaboration, a partnership of certain international uh, institutions. That's why uh, we are working very, very hard to see that uh, we get this idea of the comprehensive school in Nassau to the knowledge and uh, attention of our embassies and high commissions uh, in Nigeria and also to relate to certain uh, global centers for the education and management of uh, people with disability. We have been talking this institution with a view to finding a meeting point where there will be a consolidated collaboration between those institutions and this, this school so that we shall, we shall be a center of excellence within this area so that we can also provide wider opportunity for our children who attend that school to be able to get the, to further their education without any uh, hardship since we are getting the uh, support of such institutions. To ensure that this is achieved to the latter, a team of professors led by Professor Simon Guteng of Galudet University alongside Professor Catherine Kramer of Lake Erie College, Painesville, Ohio, USA, Professor Nina Rachel Tio Harris of Gallaudet University, Washington, D.C., USA, and Ms. Angela Afran, the African Regional Director of Perkins International, reviewed the facilities and structures of the special school immediately after the commissioning. <music> Special School is the first of its kind in the state, the best in the country and Africa at large. Governor Almakura challenged the rest of his counterparts to join in this noble task. Yes, I, I think what I, I have been running in my mind since the commissioning of that school yesterday uh, is to consider myself as a very lucky person very, very a rare, lucky person. To have an idea that I thought about many years and for God to give me the opportunity to implement that. That alone, to me, is a total satisfaction uh, for my vision. Uh, notwithstanding that, uh, since I am very close with my colleagues in the 36, 35 states of the Federation, I would try to relate to them, try to sensitize them, enlighten them about the need for the establishment of schools such as this in their various states. If not as big and comprehensive as, as this, they can start from somewhere else. And 
together, we can have a network in the country. Has it ever occurred to you that persons with disabilities are people with talents yet forgotten? Persons with disabilities, if given favorable platforms, privilege and opportunities, their potential will go a long way in adding to the development of society. This is because people with disabilities have enormous potential and abilities. When the parents see the disability of their children, they will not see the ability of their children.